What's up, pipe smokers and cigar smokers? How's it going? Good, I hope. Happy Labor Day, by the way. It's nice to have an extra day off from work. For us workers out there, right? <laughs> Anyways, I wanted to share with all of you this new humidor that I got. This thing is awesome, man. <laughs> I got it from cigarsinternational.com. Um, What's cool is it came with 30 cigars. It's a uh, Five Vegas classic humidor. It's a 100 count humidor with 30 uh, Five Vegas cigars for 150 bucks. And I've been wanting a bigger humidor, so I figure, why not, man? I couldn't pass up this deal. Anyways, it comes with a key and everything. You can lock it up, keep people out of it. And of course I had to do the whole seasoning thing. I was watching all kinds of videos about how to season a humidor and you know, which is the right way, which is the wrong way. Some people say wipe it down with distilled water. Some people say don't ever wipe it down. Um, I mostly followed the video that Cigars International put on YouTube about seasoning a humidor. Um, so <laughs> I followed their advice and it worked. And I also, um, I think they had a video on how to calibrate a hygrometer, which I also followed, um, but this is it. And yes, I, oh. <laughs> nice heavy lid for a nice seal. Anyways, I um, already have it uh, stocked up. It came with this uh, hygrometer, this little one. Came with this uh, rectangle humidification device. Um, it came with... Uh, I also have a gel. Hold on, came with a gel. Um, came with a gel. A gel jar, Humicare, little gel beads, which I keep in the bottom. Anyways, it came with um, 10 of the 5 Vegas Gold, and I will be reviewing these, I haven't had any yet. It came with 10 of the uh, 5 Vegas Classic. And unfortunately, three of these ones are kind of like cracked and flaking off, but they're going to send me some replacements, which is nice. And then it also came with these Five Vegas Series A. Look at the size of these cigars, man. I think they have like a little cedar cover on them, which is kind of neat. Um, and that's the... I don't know if you can see that. That's the bottom part of it. Got my other cigars in here. So, as you can tell, I'm definitely getting into cigars more. Um... Anyways, um, the seasoning worked. Um, it's holding around 69-70% humidity. Um, unfortunately, though, since I live in SoCal, um, I can't really keep the temperature at 70, because they say 70 degrees and 70% humidity. Well, I can pretty much keep the 70% humidity, but I can't keep that 70 degrees. It's usually around 80, um, sometimes up to 83. But I've noticed it doesn't really have a detrimental effect on the cigars, which is good. Uh, what else is cool, not, that humidor not only came with um, 30 cigars, but also came with a nice cigar cutter. Um, <clears throat> that also says Five Vegas on it. Pretty nice cigar cutter. It's got some heft to it. And uh, the Cigars International, they also had a deal where if you spend over $99 online, you get a couple um, Moretti cigar cutters. And I'm probably going to do a 300 subscriber contest soon because I'm already over 300 subscribers. Thank you, everybody. So I'll probably throw in one of these extra cutters I have. We shall see. <laughs> Also, another thing I wanted, uh, a couple more things that I got uh, also was uh, this, it's called a stinky ashtray. Look at the size of that ashtray, man. It's cool, it has these four cigar rests on it, it's real deep so you don't have to empty it as much. That was nice, this was uh, 20 bucks. Made in India, alright. And last but not least, off of eBay, um, I like Zippo lighters. And I know some people say don't ever light a cigar with a Zippo. I say light a cigar how you damn well want to light a cigar. And I always, then Hellboy, I kind of like the Hellboy movies. And he's 
always smoking a cigar, so I got this Hellboy 2 uh, lighter. Hope you can see that. Flamage. I got the fan on, so that's why the flame's moving. Anyways, Hellboy 2 lighter. So, I really like that. Anyways, uh, so now starts my journey <clears throat> in the world of cigars, officially, I guess. Now that I have a bigger humidor. Um, but this thing's pretty nice. Um, it's got a lot of heft to it. It's got some nice softness on the bottom. Um, some handles. I don't know if you can see that picture on it. Anyways, um, it's a good deal. So if you're looking for a bigger humidor um, that comes with cigars and stuff, uh, this one's 150 bucks, or you can get the humidor by itself for 100. But I mean, 30 good quality cigars for 50 bucks more, I guess, is a good deal. Uh, anyways, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you all have a good Labor Day, and I will catch you next time. Bye.